Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about how to set ODVC connection for SQL Server. So this is my channel. So if you did not uh, subscribe my channel, so please uh, subscribe for latest uh, video updates. So let's see how to set uh, ODVC connection. So first, uh, you, I will show you two method or two ways to set uh, ODVC connection. So here. So first to uh, select at your source and you have to import from database. So uh, there are no any SQL server connection available at here. So first to uh, let's click uh, triple dot and you have to use the DSN and you click on add. Now here have to go to SQL server and click on this. So at here I am going to show you my database. So this is Adam and inside the Adam this all data all tables are available. So here I am going to give the name. What name do you want to use the refer? So at here I am going to give item and uh, I need to give a description for server. So the server name is Lenovo PC. So if you like to know the server so disconnect and connect it so this is a server name then over pc now here after click on finish and here after uh, with the windows anti authentication using network so you can select windows authentication and uh, i'm going to select sql server authentication so if you select to radio version of sql server authentication so you get to uh, this option this you have to say uh, give the login for RC and the password 1234. So here see. So I selected SQL Server authentication and here I have to give if you if I select Windows so no need to give any password and here SQL Server authentication. So login for SA. So let's uh, enter 1234 and click on connect. It's connected. Now here uh, 1, 2, 3, 4 and I have given the user essay. Now click on next and here after change the database default database. So here I am going to use the Adam or database. So I'm going to select Adam and uh, no need to change here anything. Now click on next and here after if you want then you can change the language so English is better and uh, here after let's click on finish and here let's click on test so and here test completed successfully click on ok now click ok so and here see Adam3264 so it's a SQL server driver so it's a uh, uh, now it's that app here so here after click on drop down box so see Adam it's now and the username oh, that is SA and here after give the password 1234 now click on connect so see at here or oh, inside HR so this all tables are available now it's come at here so select anyone and click on ok and this table already of uh, present so now I'm going to escape this one. So let's uh, import another table. SA1234 and here inside HR I'm going to uh, import region. Now click on OK. So see at here region or table imported and uh, this is the way we can uh, uh, connect to ODVC connection with SQL Server. So now I'm going to show you the second page to uh, connect ODVC connection. Let's go to control panel and uh, here control panel. So click on system security and here after administrative tools and uh, here uh, ODVC data source. So I just uh, created that uh, data source. Now here I'm going to create uh, here from here I'm going to give one more so click on add now select 
select one more time SQL Server click on finish here yeah. so this time I'm going to connect with a mic database so see here yeah, these two tables are there so let's click on mic so it gives at your mic and here yeah, server that is Lenovo PC click on next and your yeah, SQL Server authentication SA and 1 2 3 4 click on next again here after change the database the database is mic here after click on next and here yeah, finish test the connection so it's uh, okay here yeah, click on okay so my it's mic is now it's come at here now here after click OK. Now from here I connected to from by control panel here system security this time administrative tools and audio. And here after go to power center designer and here after let's import any target from our database. So at here see mic it's now come out here give the mic and here after username essay and the password one two three four click on connect so inside the mic see this table so are there tab one tab two so here click on DVO and table so tab one so let's click import so now this let's come so this is the way we can uh, connect uh, or we can set ODBC connection by using SQL Server. So if you have any questions related to this, so leave your comment, definitely I will reply. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.